guys, it's Amy and welcome to another episode inside of Amy Lee's Land of Love. And how are you guys doing on this wonderful Saturday? Tell me all about it in the comments down below. What's the weather like where you guys are? Because for us, it's like super, super rainy and it's super, super gross. So I want to know, in fact, oh, this could be a game. Okay, in fact, I want to know where you guys live. Don't put your address. Okay, no addresses. I don't want to know your address. I want to know kind of like what city you live in. What country? It'll be super fun. Maybe we could work out that like a huge amount of cute recruits are all from the same place. So for me, currently I live in um, Yorkshire and I've lived in many, many places and I pretty much almost kind of live in London since I'm there pretty much every week. But yeah, tell me, where do you guys live? Let's work it out. Let's see where all the cute recruits are in the entire universe. It'll be super, super fun. But for now... We better get on with it and say a big good morning to my wonderful iron gooseberries. And I can see who's that. Oh, that's Bert. Oh, and Bertha. Hi, guys. Hello, Bert. How's it going? Are you looking for the block of the day? What is it today, Bert? You show me. Is it this one? Which one? This one? Oh, Bert, that one's a lovely block. Look how um wooden it is. It, it's beautiful. It really is. Bertha. Bertha. Bertha, turn around! Bertha, I'm right here! Bertha, look at me! Bertha! Honey, oh, right, let's go around here. <laughs> Bertha, can you see me? But there we go. Oh, Bertha, you lovely, lovely gooseberry. Your eyeballs are shining like cherries this morning, Bertha. They are looking delightful. Anyways, the time is running away with us as per usual. The weather is lovely inside my Minecraft world, but my real world is muddy and gross and rainy and super cold. Uh, we better give the doggies and the kitty cats their breakfast. Good morning, every. Wait, who's crying? <gasps> Who's crying? It sounds like someone's in pain. Who is it? Is it you, Sailor? Luna, what's wrong? Honey, why are you crying? You're whimpering. Okay, maybe we should take you to the vet today. I did have some things planned that I was going to build, but luckily we have an animal hospital on site. I'm going to take you to the vet, okay? We're going to go for a checkup. Don't cry, honey. It'll be okay, okay? I promise. Mummy's here. Uh, let me give the kitty cats their breakfast. Uh, Star, there's yours. Sit down, Star. Sit down. I don't want any kittens. Oh, no, they're glitching again. Now I don't know whether he's sitting or standing. Right, he's moving, so I'm guessing... Um, he's now, um, <laughs> what are you doing? Are you sitting or are you standing? I hate this glitch. It's so annoying. I don't want any more babies. I don't think I can handle any more. It's just insanity. Right, yeah, I knew, I didn't think that you were going to be, um, sitting down. Right, you're sitting down now, Star. So you stay over there. Do I have to do this with all of you? All right, there we go, Comet. All right, you're staying sitting. All right, no babies. And Saturn, all right, come over here. <laughs> no babies. Babies! Alright, sit down, sit down, sit down, sit down! Oh, no, sit down! Boys, sit down! You can't have babies! Just sit down, okay? Are we all good? Nothing's gonna happen? Everyone's sitting and chilling? We've got no baby kittens? Alright, okay. <laughs> You're too young to be daddies! We can't have any more kittens! This house will just be overrun with animals. <laughs> anyway, good morning, doggies. Oh, please stop crying, Luna! I'll take you to the vet, I promise. Let's give everyone their breakfast, okay? We have Lola here. Lola, uh, are you sitting or standing? Right, see, this is what I don't like. Every time I feed the dogs, they now stand up. I cannot risk more puppies. I'm just not ready. I am just one single girl. I cannot handle any more animals. All right, we're all good. Okay, Mars, would you like some steak? There we go. Did you get some? Oh, you need extra steak today. Right, sit down. Good job. Right. <laughs> Max, you sit there. Oh, wow. I think all of you need lots and lots of steak today. What's happened here? Maybe you're all very poorly. Right, Romeo. Right, you've got some good job, Romeo. You sit down there. Uh, we have little Sailor, of course. Sailor, there we go. Luna, would you like some? Oh, Luna, it breaks my heart to hear you cry so much. We have Boomer. Uh, Boomer, did you get any? There we go. Good job. Right, sit back down, Boomer. We have little Destiny in the corner here. Good job, Destiny. And we have Lexi. Right, so Lexi, sit down, Lexi. Sit down, no babies. No babies. Sit down, sit down. Oh, what's happening? <gasps> oh, no. What's this? What was that, Lexi? What happened? You had a baby, Lexi. Oh, <laughs> cry, Oh, Lexi, you look so happy. Okay, well, I guess 
Uh, I guess we have a new puppy, everybody. And he is socially and utterly adorable. Look how cute he is. Okay, well, that's pretty cool. Um, I was totally not expecting that, but this puppy and dog and cat glitch is driving me insane, so it's only bound to happen. So you guys need to name my brand new puppy. <laughs> okay, so not only do you need to tell me where you guys live, like what country or city, you also need to come up with a new name for our baby, which is super cute. Um, let me see. Are you a boy? or are you a girl let me see let me let me let me examine let me let me have a little look uh looks like you're a boy oh we have another little boy loves it okay so you guys need to name my little boy puppy and luna i can hear you darling okay don't worry we're taking you to the vet let's go say hello to mittens and mr frost and blizzard and then we'll take you straight to the vet okay sweetheart right mittens where are you at you're not at the door which makes me super nervous mittens mittens where is he? Mittens! What are you doing on there? Mittens. Good morning, Mr. Frost, and good morning, Blizzard. Mittens. Come on, get down from there. Do you want to go to the happy room? There you go. You guys can go down to your little playhouse, okay? You guys have fun. I need to go with Luna. She's crying. I don't know what's up with her. Um, okay, we've got to be super quick here because I really don't want Luna to be in any more pain. So let's go see Grandfather Oak super quickly. Um, come on, Luna. Oh, no, you guys have to stay in here. Go <laughs> Cry, Minnie. All these animals, I cannot even. Luna, come on, sweetheart. I know you're not very well. I know, darling. We're going to take you to the vet. Come on. Luna, come on, baby. Luna, that's it. Good job, Luna. Good job. Right, let's go see Grandfather Oak and have our story. Maybe that will make you feel better just before we go to the vets. Come on, Luna. Good job, sweetheart. Right, you sit there. Good morning, Grandfather Oak. Don't you look delightful? Grandfather Oak, can you please tell us a story? Because Luna is not very well. And can you please tell me a story? Um all about oh i know there's a ghost and the ghost lives in um a grocery store and the ghost kind of the ghost haunts the ice cream freezer can you tell me all about what the ghost gets up to and yeah i want to know all about it oh grandfather oak that was such a funny I love the part where the ice cream kept getting, like, chucked at the man who was bald. That was really fun. That ghost is surely very naughty. He's always up to mischief. Maybe he knows middens if you guys heard that story. Make sure you send me some fan art of the ghost in the ice cream freezer. I want to know all about it. It'll be super fun. Anyway, Luna, are you feeling okay? Oh, baby, please stop crying. It will be okay, I promise. We just need to do one more thing. <gasps> Bunny rabbits! And then we'll go to the vet. Okay, darling, let's go down to the cute rock rock patch to see <laughs> which cutie we have added this week. Okay, Luna? Okay, you feeling okay? Why don't you sit there, baby? You sit there. Don't run too much. Good job. Okay, the cutie we have added this week is Abby! Yay! We have... Hang on, I see that Mittens in the background. Can you see him? He's still jumping around on things, the crazy gooseberry. We added Abby because she sent me this amazing picture on Twitter of me in my wonderful land of love. And you can see it on screen right about now. How cute and colourful is that? It's all about peace and love and kindness and... And I loved it. It warmed my heart on this very chilly Saturday. So thank you very much, Abby. And welcome to the cute recruit patch. Loves it. <laughs> right, Luna. Okay, Luna. I, I hear you, sweetheart. Let's go. Let's take you to the animal hospital. You've never been there before. I know. Don't be scared, Luna. I promise it's going to be okay because I... I'm very trained in um, animal care, okay? So I'm going to give you an x-ray and we're going to figure out what's wrong with you. Don't be scared. I'll never let anything hurt you, okay? Come on then. Let's go. Right, so the animal hospital we built quite a few episodes ago. And Lexi helped me, actually. And we gave Lexi a um, x-ray. So Lexi will tell you all about it. That it's nothing to be scared of. It won't hurt. It's going to be just fine, okay? The gingerbread tea house! One of my favorite builds on Minecraft. In fact, if you want to learn how to build that you should buy or check out the minecraft annual the one that was out last christmas it shows you exactly how to make that building it was very cool um right let's go this way we're gonna go down um past the show jumping arena which we haven't done in a very long time luna in fact we should do that how are you feeling luna are you okay don't be scared sweetheart i promise okay 
I promise. Look, I have flowers. You know you love flowers. Come on then, Luna. It's not far away. In fact, I can see it just in front of us. You see that big white building with the big green cross on it? Or the X? Or what do you call it? Yeah, it's a cross. Although it is night time. Would you prefer to do it in the daytime, honey? Would you prefer to have a little nap? Yeah? Okay, let's go and sleep. And then in the morning, we can get you checked out. Because I am worried about you. And it sounds like you're in pain. And I don't want to hear you be in pain, my little sweetie. Right, so let's Hi. sleep in here. I think we can. The kitty kingdom. Yeah, there's some beds in here, Luna, okay? Luna? Luna, come on. It's okay, I promise. I know it's the cat kingdom. But they won't mind, especially if you're being poorly. They won't mind if you're in here, okay? So good night, Luna. I'll see you in the morning. And good morning, how are you feeling? Oh, your little mouth is all swollen and everything. Okay, come on, Luna, it is time. Let's take you to the animal hospital. There is the bowling alley. We should do that. In fact, there's so many buildings in my land of love that I barely even do anything with anymore. We have the archery range over there. We have the ice cream cafe place here. We have the movie theater. We have the space observatory thing. We have a massive swimming pool. We have the theater here, but here is the animal hospital. Are you ready, sweetheart? Okay, now I know you're gonna be a little bit frightened, but I promise it's not gonna hurt, okay? I'm gonna be very gentle. Come on, sweetheart. Right, let's get in here. Come on. Luna, good girl. I know, it's going to be all over really soon, okay? Right, so let's go in here where we can have an initial consultation to see if we can listen to your heartbeat and stuff. Luna, come on. Don't be scared. That's it, Luna. Good job, Petal. Good job. Right. Can you go on there for me? I need you to step up on here. Good job. We've got the scales right here so we can weigh you, but I don't think um, you're overweight or underweight. I think we need to listen to your heart. So I do believe in here we have a stethoscope. So let me get my stethoscope ready. Okay, so don't move, okay? Right. I need you to be really quiet so I can listen to your heart, okay? Your heartbeat is going quite fast, Luna. Let me put the stethoscope back in. I don't know if that's because you're scared or nervous. So what I think we need to do is give you an x-ray. So come on over here, Luna. Uh, we are going to go into the x-ray room, okay? Are you with me? Honey, don't be scared. I promise it's gonna be I'm, I'm trapped it's gonna be okay Luna come on Luna she's running with Luna don't be scared okay don't be frightened come on baby look I have steak for you when you finish I do I know you don't want to be in pain either Luna come on sweetheart <laughs> it's gonna take me like a million years to get her in the exo room Luna come on Oh, nearly got you in. There we go. She really does not want an x-ray. <laughs> it's going to be okay, Luna. I promise. Right, so let's pop you in here, okay? Good job. Okay, don't be afraid. Lexi had an x-ray. She was really, really good, all right? And then we figured out what the problem was. Okay, so let's pop you in there. There we go. Don't worry. Okay, now close your eyes, and we're going to press this button, and once we press it, the x-ray will begin, okay? There we go. Oh, it sounds really weird, doesn't it? <laughs> like a proper machine. Oh, and it's ready. Okay, right, let's let you out. There we go. Super quick, wasn't it? Wasn't that bad? Right, so now I need to click on the computer and it's going to print us an x-ray and here it is. And then let's put it on the uh, wall and see if we can figure out the problem. Ah, I see. There's something wrong with your mouth, Luna. You see that? Ha, huh, it looks like you might have a little tooth that's a little bit wobbly. So I think we might need to cut that out. Are you ready? We can do it. Come on then. We're going to have to go to the surgery room. And uh, we're going to have to prep you for surgery. And then I'm going to have to cut that little tooth out, okay? It's going to be all right, Luna. Don't be afraid. It's going to be okay. Right, come on, sweetheart. Come down to the surgery room. Come on, Luna. Whew, right, that was a bit of a mission. But we finally got Luna on the examination table we're gonna have to give you a little bit of surgery okay so i need to get dressed up so let me go ahead and pop this on so we've got a little hat here uh we have our little leather tunic and we have the green pants and now we have our boots so we can go ahead and check us out and i think we're gonna look really really cool there we go now we look like a proper surgery person what do we even call them doctors <laughs> maybe okay luna are you gonna be okay it's gonna be just fine so let me go get some tools we have a scalpel right here and we also have some surgical forceps all right honey right so i'm gonna have to cut open your gum just a little bit okay it's gonna be all right okay 
That's it. Good job. Good job, Luna. You can do this. Good job. Well done. There we go. Oh, I know. I know it hurts, honey. I can see the problem. Luna, I can see the tooth. I can see it. It's really, really sharp. No wonder it's causing you pain. Right, so what I need to do now is get my surgical forceps. And I'm going to have to squeeze and pull that little tooth out, okay? Be brave, Luna. I've got it, okay? I see it. The tooth is coming. The tooth is coming. And there it is. Luna, I got it. I got your little tooth. Look at it. It's so super cute. Look, Luna, this is what's causing you all the problems. It's okay, sweetheart. It's over now. Wow, that was really scary. But look, this is your tooth. What do you think? I think you need to have a little rest now. So let's take you down uh, to the little rest place. Come on, Luna. Don't worry, look, I've got your steak now because you've been such a good girl. Oh, your poor little mouth. That must have been really painful. Can I keep this tooth forever? <gasps> Maybe we could get the tooth fairy to come visit. That'd be really fun. Okay, Luna, come on. Luna, come on. Come on. <laughs> now I'm stuck. Luna, you cheeky monkey. Now I have to go all the way through here. <laughs> Luna, come on. Let's put you to sleep, my darling. Good job, Luna. You are very brave. Have some steak, okay? And I'm going to leave you here so you can get a nice, lovely rest. Wow, what a day. I was not expecting to be a vet today. Okay, Luna, you stay here, okay? And have a lovely rest, and I'll come and get you in the morning. All right, my sweetheart? You've done very well, and I'm super, super proud of you, okay? Have a little lovely, jubbly love, love petal. There we go. Fantastic. She's got her flowers. She'll be okay. Well, guys, that was a crazy episode. Poor little Luna. I cannot believe we have a little tooth. Look at that. This was Luna's tooth. How super cute. Maybe we need to figure out a way where we can meet the tooth fairy, which will be super awesome. But thank you guys so very much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Also, don't forget to name my puppy. The person who picks the name will become a cute recruit. And like I said before... Sometimes um, the same name is repeated by many, 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 many people. So it's very difficult to figure out who is the first person to name the dog. So if, you know, a name is picked that's said a million times, then all of those people will become cute recruits. You know what I mean. But anyway, yeah, I want to know exactly where you guys are from in the whole world. And I want you to name my puppy. Very exciting times. Check out the link down below, which will take you straight to my Amazon, where you can check out my brand new book, Emily and the Megalo of Doom. I love you guys muchly. Good.